How's it going guys? It's Josh aka Olufemi. And my name is Dane Holroyd. And this video is called How to Break into Directing Commercials at 21. Now before this video starts, I'm actually proud to announce that it's being sponsored by one of the coolest companies ever, Sennheiser. And everything that you're hearing is being recorded by the new Sennheiser Evolution Wireless G4 mic system. With this system, you have the option of choosing either the 100p series or the 500p series, which includes an even higher end lav mic. Now before going to interview Dane, I tested the 100 series mic system with the ME2 lav mic Testing in a couple different one, environments two, three, with varying levels two, of background sound, three, and was actually one, two, really three. impressed by the quality Testing that I got one, back. Two, it's actually really funny because I can tell you from experience, good sound quality from lav mics is rare in general. So a quick intro on Dane, he's a 21-year-old American-born filmmaker raised in Santa Barbara, California. He was my top film student during his high school days, and he's currently studying film production here at Bond University in Gold Coast, Australia. Most recently, I flew back to the States to direct a campaign for Honda and Acura, and I want to share a little bit about how I got to this point. Before agencies and production companies can trust you with a big budget, they need to see that you can pull off commercials. The best way to do this? spec work. Yes, I know some people say that spec spots are cheating. You can't just slap a Nike logo at the end of a project. But I really think the only way to get into making commercials is by making commercials. And it doesn't matter if it's fake. I try to look at my spec work and innovate. I try to do new styles and new things that people aren't doing. If you can find a niche and find your own voice, people will want to work with you. Let's say you're a big director that does car commercials. If you want to make that jump to comedy and action, the only way to do that is to make a fake project that shows you can do comedy. Nobody's gonna trust a car commercial guy to do a comedy spot unless they've seen that he can do comedy. Check out this Under Armour spec ad I directed over a year ago. Don't worry, it's only 30 seconds. Making commercials is a team sport and you can only get so far by yourself. And I have to rely action. on people who specialize in each category from DPing to gaffing to lighting to casting to locations. My third tip, use Instagram as a tool. Follow the top production companies. Follow your favorite DPs and directors. Send them a DM. Constantly looking at work, seeing what everybody's doing, getting involved in the industry, that's what really helps you. You need to know what you're talking about. When somebody says Ian Pond's Jewel just directed a new spot, you need to know who Ian Pond's Jewel is and what spot he just directed. Use your Instagram as a portfolio. People can go to your Instagram and quickly look to see your style and the type of work you do. Alright guys, we're gonna take a quick break. It's so dope now to go through tutorials now with free hands. If you've watched the channel at all over the last three years, you know that I've refused to use any type of lav mic whatsoever. This is because lav mics in general have not given me the sound quality that I desire. Because of that, I've had to use distractive handheld mics that have really distracted my presentation. So it's pretty cool Sennheiser actually offered to sponsor this video and let me use their new Sennheiser Evolution Wireless G4 lav mic. So I really like the sound quality of this mic. The fact that it's wireless is pretty convenient as well. The G4 comes in two versions, the 100p series and the more advanced 500p series. So one tip that you got to do with all these wireless mics is something that Sennheiser calls the easy setup. It basically just allows the mic to find the best wireless frequency that isn't being used by other wireless devices. It just prevents any annoying buzzing noises from happening during recording. Once you got all that set up, you're going to have incredible audio. Two tips when using labs, don't place it too high on your body or else it'll sound muffled. I prefer center chest. And second, take note of the acoustics of your room. Make sure it's not too echoey. So please give this mic a chance. You can actually support the channel by making a purchase in the link in the description below. I don't think you'll be disappointed. All right, let's go back to Dane's tips. My fourth tip, email. 
spots. Once you have three to four spots that you really feel strong about and that speak to your vision and your style, send those to production companies and agencies. This is actually how I landed with Los York, which is my US production company. Based in LA and New York, the co-founder, Seth Epstein, really took me under his wing and taught me everything there is to know about commercials. And I really owe it all to him for taking the time to really teach me every little step. I don't think Los York would have responded to me if I didn't have work to show them. You can't just send an email, hi, I'm looking for representation and not send any work or send a resume. What is a resume going to do? That doesn't show anything about your style or your voice. And that's your job as a director is to have a style, a voice, a way you look at the world. My last tip, perfect your director's treatments, perfect your director's treatments and perfect your director's treatments. I can't stress this enough. Like really, if you have great treatments, you'll win jobs. If you don't, you won't. You need to share your ideas visually to a client, to an agency. Let's say you're up against the top directors in the world. Let's just say a million dollar campaign and your vision for this idea is so clear and so crisp. So you see it happening. You could potentially beat out the biggest names in the industry because of your vision. And the only way to show that is through the treatment. All right, guys, you've heard it from the legend himself. Landing a massive commercial project is actually possible. It just requires a strategic, persistent, and timely approach. You can follow Dane on his Instagram, Dane Holroyd, me at Made by Olufemi, and of course, our friends at Sennheiser at Sennheiser. If there's anything else you'd like us to cover, please make sure to put it in the comments below. Please make sure to like this video and subscribe to our channel and make sure to click on the notification bell so you can be notified when we upload new content. Thanks so much for watching guys and as always remember to keep it chill.